Oh wow, look what just came out today, Gloomhaven on as early access. Now, if you're not familiar with Gloomhaven, it's actually a very well-received um, RPG in a box or a tabletop RPG. Um, not the tr traditional D&D, but this one is actually, you know, uh, in a bar box, models, all that kind of stuff. It's a complete package, and it was always very well received. Um, it is an expensive game, but it has come down in price quite a bit. Uh, me and my friends have never picked it up, but we've always really wanted to play it. And now's my chance to check out some of the digital. Uh, so like I said, it did come out today, firing up for the first time. Let's check it out. Uh, now, it looks like we have tutorial campaign. That's all locked out. Yeah, locked out. Okay, so I guess we're just going to have to hit up adventure. Now, I don't know much about the mechanics of Gloomhaven, but I know that you do go into, you know, the dungeon, the dungeon crawl with your your abilities is basically a deck, a deck of cards. It's your hand, and it's it's supposed to be awesome. So I've been really looking forward to playing this. So what do we got here? we got a couple of characters. This is what we're going in as. Doom Crushers. Uh, change party. Oh, uh, two heroes, three heroes, four heroes. Okay. Um... Oh, well, that's kind of cool. So what do they got? Four different characters for us to check out right now? Well, let's Doom Crushers, Venom Strike, Earthbound. Let's try Venom Strike. Let's have one ugly dude and one elf girl person. All right. Uh, Kraycar, yeah. Okay, okay, that's fine. Let's hit it. Start. Uh, so like I say, first time going through this, so we're going to keep it on normal, as I don't even know how to play Gloomhaven as a board game in itself. So sometimes these can be a little uh, tough to pick up on, but we'll figure it out. Now, this game is developed by Asmodee, who does pub produce a lot of these digital board game uh, for, for PC. But I've always honestly been pretty happy with their products. Anyways, welcome mercenaries. While drinking at the Wayward Inn, you overhear snippets of conversation between two town militia. Apparently, a local bandit commander has come into possession of a number of heretical, heretical uh, texts and has begun researching necromancy. Okay. Oh, where are we going? You are well aware the magical research often requires a handy supply of gold, and after asking around, you discover his hideout's whereabouts. Okay. Obviously, you are unprepared to assault his base just yet, so you prepare to leave Wayward and head off to raid some local crypts in search of knowledge and some better equipment. Let's start the adventure. All right. Uh, start a journey, choose a path uh, to a settlement, following a journey, return back to the... St oh, failing a journey will return back to the starting village, which I'm assuming is wayward here. Okay, cool. We got our guys. I mean, should we look? So, okay, so these are going to be the ability cards. This is what I'm going to be going in. And I think as your characters level up, you kind of get to swap these out or get new ones. I, I really don't know. We'll figure it out. Okay, so what do we got? The Burn Tavern. Okay, that looks like it gets a little harder. And that's red, so it's probably super hard. Yeah, difficulty hard. Okay, so it's going clockwise. We'll start with the uh, Burn Tavern. Start the journey. Yes, please. The Armory. Okay. Now, the map looks very similar to what the Gloomhaven board, like the art style. Very nice, very nice. Let's do it. Fire in there. Travel to destination. Kill all enemies, Bandit Guard, and Bandit Ucher. Okay. I think we could do that. <laughs> Encounter. Okay, ask him. Uh, up ahead, you see... You see a, a cordal? What? Suspended from a tree by his ankles. Oh, God. As you approach, he notices you and cries out. Hey, you there, travelers. Help a poor tinker out, would you? Ask him what happened. I was attempting to combine that there net shooter and hook gun. He gestures towards the strange combination of contraption on the floor behind him. When the darn thing misfired, next thing I know, I'm hanging upside down from the tree. Any chance you can cut me down? Rob. <laughs> oh, my God. Leave him be. Attempt to help him. This feels weird. This, I think this is a setup, but man, I can't just rob the little guy. That's, oh, that would be way more fun though. No, 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 come on. Attempt to help him. I'm probably gonna get, I'm gonna get ambushed here. So there's some bullshit going on. I mean, some shenanigans. <laughs> you cut the rope and the cordal manages to land. Cordal, it's not some race. I don't know what I'm missing. Land gracefully on the ground. Thank you kindly. Not too many folks traveling in these area, uh, in these parts nowadays was scared I'd be up there for days or worse still. He reaches into one of the many pouches fastened by the and pulls out a small handful of coins. Here's a small token of my appreciation. You bid each other farewell. Oh, nice. Okay. See? Good. It was good we didn't rob him. See? Yeah. You gained 15 gold. Could have maybe got more if you robbed him, but whatever. It's not the point. Let's get in there and get rid of these bandits. So I haven't even really looked at screenshots for this game. Not sure how it looks. Ooh, okay. Okay, you can zoom in. Uh, you can use your WASP keys. Oh, let's get a... Okay, nice zoom out. 
Eh, interesting. Looks good. Not like a lot of shadows or shading or anything, but I'm curious how big some of these maps get. Okay, anyways. Now, I might just touch, touch, uh, touch up the sound a little bit. Might minimize on me. One second. Nope, and it did not. Good, good, good. Okay. So, this looks like our initiative. So, these are my guys. Yeah, we're right here. Okay, we'll still deal with the scoundrel. So, uh, so it looks like we can probably pick two, two of these, I think, we can set up. Um, I'm, I'm not sure what the numbers. I'm assuming that's kind of some kind of action cost or something like that. Flanking strife. Okay, oh, so let's move our guys first, maybe. Go here. You go here. Backstab, attack. Range three. Ooh, throwing knives. I think that might work. Smoke bomb. Next attack while invisible. Double the amount of... Ooh, so you go invisible. Let's try that. Okay, so it looks like I got two out of two queued up. Let's try uh, Mr. Pretty over here. Handsome boy. Earth and Claw. Attack. Range five. That sounds good. Maybe these can't add up to 100 or something like that. Oh, no. That doesn't make sense. Crater and a crazy crater range. One, two, three. That should be able to reach those guys. Okay, I think that's it. We got both. I think we kind of line these abilities up. Yeah. All right. And selection. Let's try it. Ooh, boy. I don't know if I'm going to survive. I could be missing a lot of stuff. Move attack. Okay, so that's just what they're going to be doing. Okay, so we're with our scoundrel. Throwing knives. Schmick bam. Maybe I should do smoke bomb first. Double the value of your attack and gain. Okay. So let's try that then. Smoke bomb? Oh, hell yeah. Okay, so that guy's invisible now. So will I get... Ooh, I can't use my throwing knives? Oh, what is what is the loot section? Oh, right, do they both different abilities or something? Let's try loot. So, okay, so that was like some kind of a passive ability on that. All right, I think that's the end of his turn. I was hoping I would be able to... One, two, three, one, two. Maybe too far away. Okay, and Scoundrel's turn. Oh, God. Craig Hart's going way later. Okay. Choose how Craig Hart will be... Oh, it will be damaged. Burn one available card. Oh, interesting. Receive two damage. Um, maybe we should burn a card, because we've got a lot right now. Sure, we'll burn a card. I don't really know any of these, so let's just get rid of... That's kind of cool. We'll get rid of the rock tunnel, though. Okay, come on. Okay, I'm learning. We're learning. Okay, oh, that was three, though? Dang. All right, we better, better take a hit here. Okay, too bad. So it's his turn now? Uh, attack, range of five. So should be able to hit one of these buggers. Let's just try it. Let's try it. Looks like there's a passive of heal, but then... Oh, I get it. Okay. So if if, if I if you use the top of one card, it's like you have to use the opposite of the other. Ooh, okay. Okay. Interesting. It's getting the brain going. Uh, yeah. All right. Look, well, I just want to do this attack because it is a f range of five. So let's try it out. That's the elite. Let's try and get rid of one of these punks at least. Like this guy. Yeah, it's gonna do a lot of damage. Let's try. Uh, confirm targets, I guess. Okay. Well, all these traps are showing up. Okay, so he, they actually, she actually took some pretty good damage. And now, what are we gonna do? All adjacent allies and enemies suffer one damage. What? My bud? Noted. Move forward, jump. All adjacent. I think that's what's gonna happen. Yeah, Scoundrel took a hit. Damn. I guess we'll burn a card. Nah, take the hit, boy. Yeah, take the hit, dude. Okay, wow. Oh, and now we can move on this guy's turn? Yeah, let's move. Let's get right in this guy. Uh, no. Oh, I probably can't go there because of the obstacle. So do I want to move adjacent to him or right into them? I'll leave the Scoundrel for him, and he's going to go tank these melee guys. So what happens if... Confirm movement. Am I supposed to go like right into his space? Yep. 
Oh, nice. That look kind of dope. Uki. Uh, confirm movement. Yeah, that's... Oh, he can still move? Wow. He can't go there, can he? No. All right. Oh, oh, he gets to do it again. I didn't realize that. Okay, I should have read more. And Craycart's turn. Burn a card. I guess we should... Yeah, it's a bit bad hit. Avalanche. No, but we need the... Just take the hit, man. Oh, no. Well, he wouldn't do a trap. I think I should have burned the card on the three damage. Dirt Tornado? Actually, that would be kind of dope on the next one. Yeah, backup ammunitions. Get Burn that. Get out of here. We don't need you. But I think once you run out of abilities, out of cards, that's it. Then you're screwed. So it's like you really got to be careful how you spend your abilities. I'm pretty sure that's what's up. End round. Okay, interesting. Now we're back to picking our abilities. So, Kraker, I saw you have this Dirt Tornado. Attack 1, range 2. Muddle, all allies in the enemy. Okay, cool, 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 cool. I think I like that. A crushing Grasp? Sure, why not? Loot 1, move 3, so I can only... Oh, I don't want to do that. Something that we're... Ooh, that might be good. If I'm reading that proper, I think I can get these two guys right here with this. Let's get rid of Dirt Tornado. Do Rumbling Advanced. Okay, so we got two for that. Sorry, a little bit of reading involved here. Obviously, you got to learn these abilities. Uh, back to the Scoundrel, who I want to get up there, but it doesn't look like he can move right now. Backstab. Ooh. Yeah, I want something where I can move up to that guy. Special mixture and f and flanking strike, I think. Okay. Okay, alright, alright. So we're starting with the scoundrel first. He is invisible, so that's going to give him some bonus damage. And I want to kind of get him on the elite archer. So attack three, uh, what did I want to do? I want to. I need to move him up there. Oh, what? Why is this? I thought this was... Uh, we can do this, yeah. So move three. Go here. Yep, conform. Okay. And now I want to do the attack. And I think I skip, because uh, that's all I want to move. I don't think it's, yeah, perfect, perfect. Oh, and I think this is... Okay, now I think this is the poison follow-up. Confirm target. Yeah, that's the poison follow-up on that. Looks like it got him. Noise. Now, attack three plus two. Attack again. Wait, what target is adjacent to it? Oh, I should have read further. I didn't read enough. <laughs> oh, well. Let's just do the attack. Confirm. Ooh, she's down. Oh, yeah. Hell yeah. I think did some bonus damage could be uh, invisible like that. I think she still is invisible. Okay, and Scoundrel's turn. Nice. Wow, so you really got... That's... Yeah, that's... Uh, that's interesting. Interesting, interesting. Uh, how does Scoundrel want to take four damage? Not good. We better burn a card. Running out of cards, though. How much health? Man, just take the hit. Yikes. Down to six health. That's not good. Better burn a card. Sure. I don't know if that's really good. Yeah, I don't know what these numbers indicate. That should be probably important. Oh, did that miss? Thank God. Okay. So I kind of want to do avalanche because I think I can get these two guys. Yeah. Okay. Confirm targets. Check out this apple. Oh, got one of them. Okay. Now we get to move. All adjacent allies and enemies suffer one damage. Oh, maybe I should just go. Hit. Maybe I should just take the trap damage. Oh, it's two damage though. But then my one damage would kill him, so he wouldn't even get a turn. I'm so tempted to do that. 
this might be a really bad move, but I'm kind of tempted to do this. I'll take the trap damage, but I'll be able to kill the guy on this turn, which might in turn produce less damage if he does more. <laughs> Let's just do it. <laughs> ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> dig it, just dig it. Yeah, there we go. And that ability killed up. Nice. All right, cool, 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 cool. End crate card's turn. All right. End round. Down to one bandito. Okay, what do we got? Crushing grasp. So we need to be able to move to him there. Yeah, at least get dirt tornado in. Got to see that, or at least use the movement. Unstoppable, upheaval, all allies suffer that. Crushing grasp. We'll do that because yeah. Long rest. Interesting. Heal to refresh all of your spent item cards. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Short rest. Okay, well, he's got two, so we'll go to the Scoundrel. And, okay, that's Killer Movement and Attack, so we'll put that in there. And we'll even just put uh, Venom Shiv in. Quick hands? Two, move, two, one, two. Oh, okay. No, we'll put Venom Shiv. All right, perfect. And Suliction. All right. Three attack one. So he's, he's, he's going to do fuck all. He can't do a thing. I mean, excuse the French. He's going to do fudge all. <laughs> move five. Uh, one, two, three. Oh, yeah, we can get there in time. Attack three, plus two attack, and again, when the target is adjacent to any of your Ulai's, which that's not going to be the case, add plus two, again, when it's adjacent, it's just none of it, none of its allies. So I'm still going to get the plus two, so let's move five. We'll go, can't get, can I just get the loot? I would, I would think so. Give me the money. Give me the money. Okay. Now we're going to be doing the super backstab killer attack, even though we're not really attacking the back, but anyways. Confoying. Oh, one hell. Okay, that's it for the scoundrel. Get the money. Oh, girl, look out. Oh, she didn't take any damage from it, though. Okay, move and attack. Perfect. Confoin. Ability selection activated. Okay, yep, okay, and attack. Here we go. Very nice. Good job, boys. I mean, uh, boys and girls. End round. I think that's it, right? Kill all enemies. That was all enemies, no? Long rest? Sure. Is there is there a doorway? I, okay. Oh, there's more to deal with. Okay. We ain't done yet. I think this is this dungeon's going to continue on. Uh, long rest. Select an ability card to lose, then gain. Oh, I didn't know that. Uh oh. <laughs> Shit. Venom Shiv, special new heal summon. Well, I've already used those. Okay. Then I guess if anything, Craig, boy, Earth and Cloud. Yeah, we'll do that one. Confirm. Earth and Claw. Okay. So I was assuming this was going to be done, but nope. Start for each year. It was like two ability cards or choose to rest. Yeah. Oh, right, right. So we want something that we can move. Sure. Venom Shiv and yeah, do that and then heal. Okay. There's a move. And there's a heal. Perfect. Do it. Okay. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five. Open door. Yeah, do it, bro. Oh god. I am not prepared for this. If I if that's all I have for my ability cards, I am screwed. <laughs> okay. Well, you get a heal though, dude. I mean, uh, do that. Okay, very nice. And scoundrels. Oh, dude, this is bad. I don't, I don't know if, because I feel like if, if you run out of your abilities, like I say, I think you're screwed. <laughs> yeah, let's move three and heal four. I'm coming, bro. Broheem. Oh, I can heal her. Ah, oh, she is full. You better heal up, bro. Yeah. Heal up, pretty boy here. Scoundrel has got to get out of there. Hmm. 
I don't even have any movement for this guy. Posing strike. Well, we'll dang, we'll just select two and go. Huh, oh man, I'm, I'm feeling stuck now. Now that I have minimal abilities and we just, we got this fresh batch of uh, banditos on us. Or do you get your hand back when you go through all of your abilities? That might be the case. I'm, I'm certainly hoping so, man. I got four guys to deal with. Attack, loot, yeah, shield. I can't even attack though. Oh, Scantrel took damage from that? What? Oh, I thought that would have helped. Okay. Well, you can't really do anything. Skip attack. It's my Craig Hart. Hmm. I'm going to have to back Scoundrel up. Got to get, get her out of there. Yeah, you guys are going to have to chase, chase us down. Okay, so we're going to move. No, we're going to move. Oh, is that, is that all I can do? Yeah, shiza. Can I move two? Okay. Skip the attack. Ability select alternate. Oh, that's nothing to attack, though. Alright, end the scoundrel. Now, I just don't know how, if I can replenish any of my cards. will be discarded. No. Attack, so is that one that maybe doesn't go out go away. Single out. Start turn for sure. Select two ability cards or choose to rest. Do I have to rest? Is that what's going on? I might have to rest. But I don't burn quick hands, redraw. In, ooh, wow, 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 wow. But I need cards. Burn Thieves Knack. Oh, I'm, so I'm, I'm, I'm unclear on how ability cards refresh. Okay, so I just got some back. Lose one discarded card at random in order to recover all cards. Yes, short rest. I think that's what I need. Yeah, uh, redraw. Damage self? No, just burn whatever. Okay, here we go. So at least we got a few things back. Yeah, we're just gonna have to gonna have to move in there. I don't know if they're gonna come out this way. Move three. I'm not gonna be able to do anything. Ah, well, whatever. And selection. Yeah, get closer, dudes. <laughs> Don't tap your shield at me. Okay, uh, we gotta move. Move five. Let's just let's just get right in there, man. We gotta get this going. Confoyant. Would be better just to, like, let them funnel in one by one, but... We'll move this along. I'm... Okay, and then he... what am I gonna do? I'm gonna heal. Ooh, guess so. That's it for movement. Okay. Yep, we gotta heal. And come for him. It's only gonna take the two. Not gonna take the full, but whatever. Better than nothing. Then I might have to short rest again to get more abilities in. Not too sure. Okay. All we got is the three movement. Oh, could I? Oh, I think I could have gone one more step. Dang it, dang it, dang it. And we can't do anything there. Okay. And the Craig Hearts. Okay, so, so now we're back to the Scoundrel. So I have Opposing Strike. Let's just do it before I even do anything else. Now, can I do a short lose one discarded card? Oh, disc. so those are in the discard. The ones that are in the gray. 
Oh, and this, and this is the Cray card anyways. Jeez. There we go. Okay, we're going to do quick hands. And on your next four attacks, target enemies adjacent. Let's do that. I like that. And that. Okay. That's good. And now as for Cray card, uh, we're going to do the short rest. I guess we're going to get rid of Crushing Grasp. And then, okay. Now these are completely out of the discard. I think... I'm starting to piece it together a bit, but yeah, I still I still don't have all the mechanics down, but gotta move. Yeah, gotta move. And selection. No! Three damage. I, I can't afford to lose cards. Crap. Oh, this is gonna suck. Nice girl. Nice. Oh, he's pissed about that. He's dropping a deuce. God damn it. We can take a hit. Bandits are dropping deuces everywhere. Hey, where are you going? God damn it. Oh, 3 0. Oh, dude. Okay, you're gonna have to move. Let's get you let's get you right in there. We're gonna attack. I guess that's it. Alright, do it. Now he's almost dead. One health. Okay, back to the scoundrels. Your next four attacks starting again. Yeah, but then we'll move to... Okay, yeah, let's do that. That's fine. Okay, buff up. Then we get a move to and attack. So we can at least go here and finish this guy off. So that I'm okay about. Confirm my point. Skip my point. Confirm attack. Do it. Oh, sit down. Thank you, sir. Okay, and that's it. Okay, now what's this? So we so we only have two in the discard, and the rest of these, uh, excuse me, are completely out. <laughs> okay, I'm trying to get it. And you still got four. What does single out do? So these are like abilities that you can keep using. I'm confused on that. But regardless. These are out, so I think lose one discarded card at random in what long rest. Choose one discarded card to become lost cover all other Oh, I think I have to do this. No, no. Cover all other discarded. But the, so, but I only have two that are discarded. So then I'll be down to one ability. I have to do this. Or lose one card at random in order to recover all other discarded cards. I'm still kind of... Hmm. Redraw. Damage self. Sure. Oh, he's gone. Oh, he's dead. Oh. Yeah. Ext extinguish. Cray card has died due to lack of availability cards. That's... Yep. Okay. So, yeah. When you run out of cards, you're out. And I, I kind of already knew that. I kind of understood that. But yeah, so so it just really makes you think of how you got it, how you approach each ability. Wow, 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 wow. But I'm I'm out of abilities. I have to I have to do this. Short rest. Yeah. Yeah, burn it. Yeah, go to hell. So that's in the burn pile. And it gets me down to basically three kind of attacks. Loot. So I'm not gonna be able to do this, so there's the poison. Can we do single out? Yeah, it's like it's like you can't use single out. Yeah, so this is basically going to be his last turn. Okay, continue. And, and selection. Yeah, there's no way. But hey, we learn. We're learning. We learned a lot. Oh no. Ah, oh, good night, sweetheart. 
Defeat. Okay. Yeah. Finish. Finished. Yikes. Well, we definitely learned a lot there. Welcome. Or something while drinking out the way we're in. Okay. So we're basically. I think it just basically threw us right back to the beginning of the adventure. Let's try that again. Especially now that I kind of. I think I understand the card mechanic a little bit better. Start adventure. Should I keep the scoundrel? I think. I think this is still a good combo. Burn, yeah. Hit it up. Here we go. Decaying tombs. Ooh, wow. Okay, adventure. Let's tr try it again. Gloomhaven. I definitely need to be able to finally play this game. Because, yeah, I still want to get a copy of that board game. All right, look at all our sweet abilities now. So it's once you use an ability, it goes into the discard. And when you want to refresh it, you need, you need to do your short rest, but one of your discarded cards you're gonna get everything back but one of them is gonna be burned okay i'm get, i'm kind of getting it i'm kind of getting it you're gonna get it okay we got some skellies that's fine credit card do your thing what do we got mass so we'll move what do we need one two i just need a couple of movement let's see do let's do rumbling advanced now do, will it do the damage when i get there or from where i'm leaving probably where i'm leaving but we'll try it anyways and then, so that's gonna be the bottom one. And then we'll do, oh, but that's a sweet heal though. Shit, hard to pick now. Is there a movement up top? Not that I'm really seeing, nope. That's a good move. Yeah, we'll do, oh, but it's Dirt Tornado, guys. <laughs> yeah, we'll do that. Dirt Tornado, and then, Don't think that's gonna get the other guy, but we'll try it. Okay, and then for Scoundrel. Too bad there's an obstacles in the way. Yeah. Someone's gonna have to take a hit on that trap there. Make it Craig Hart to do that. Uh, but I don't think oh yeah, then we're gonna need more movement. Yeah, because I'm gonna I'm gonna get Craig Hart in there. That's right. There we go. Let's do it. Okay, back to Scoundrel. <sighs> so much thinking. Okay, five? Yeah. Get Scoundrel up to the skeleton, dude. And backstab attack? Sounds dope. Let's do it. Dope queen. Oh, God. Please don't do anything. Ooh, I think that missed. Hello, sir. Ooh, a three damage? Oh, dang it. See, I don't want to burn a card anymore. Because that's that just completely takes it out of the deck. So we'll take the... Ah, oh, that's so much damage, though. Oh, this guy's mean. We'll take the damage, man. I don't want to burn cards right off the bat. Okay, so we're two... We're on the scoundrel. Don't really need to move anymore. Attack three and poison. Attack three plus two. When the oh, yeah, it's by itself. Good, good, good. Ooh, maybe this could be a good chance to... Two. Uh, he'd have. I don't. I don't know if she can go through him. Probably not. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, she can still get there though. We better gang up on this guy first off, anyways. Poison three. We'll do this backstab. Twin flame. Good hit. Yeah, girl. Fuck. <laughs> nice. Okay. Uh, move her. I guess so. Might as well take advantage of that. Craig still might go through here. Okay. And I think that's it. Okay, now for Craig. <laughs> Craig. I'm just going to call him Craig. <laughs> yeah, I actually, I'm going to go here. It's going to suck, but that's how she goes. Confirm. Take the two. Ow. Yeah, we'll take it. Take it like a man. Take a look at Confirm. Yeah, that's fine. And now we should be able to do... I think this will get both of them. There we go. Yay, confirm. And I think it's going to clear them out. Oh, that's how you do it. Nice. Okay, good job, guys. And Craig Hart's turn. Okay. And Craig's turn. <laughs> Craig. 
Okay, end the round. All right, now we know we need to proceed to the next room. Ugh. Oh, that's good kombucha. Okay. So we're gonna have to move, let's move Craig in first. But we're just gonna move all, need to move all that movement though. Wait, I can get rid of, what's, where's my obstacle destroying ability he has? I know you got one in here. Yeah, here we go. Destroy an obstacle. So I'm assuming that's an obstacle I can destroy. And then once I do that, can I get a movement? That's a top ability. Yep. Move three. Sure. Perfect. Okay. Scoundrel. Scoundrel. We need a moving. F that's a good move. Smoke bomb skis. Yeah, we'll do that. Okay. That's a good prep. I should be getting all that gold, but I'm just I'm just so concerned about having enough abilities to get into the next battle that I don't want to be m wasting movements. So we are going to oh I'd rather have Craig go first. Oh that that determines the initiative. Oh, I would assume that makes sense. I'm assuming those numbers of the ability kind of help determine the initiative of the bat of the next battle. Oh, okay, cool, 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 cool. I get it, I get it. Okay, so I guess we'll move and go invisible so I'll move i just go here you can take the long way even though he's gonna bust that down whatever and then we'll go invinsky's confine okay now it's craig's turn uh destroy one adjacent thingy majig yep that no 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 not that one no no i was oh oh it gets all of them oh oh nice Destroy one adjacent obstacle. It got rid of two for me, though. Strange. Okay, and then we got the movement. So, should be able to... Open the door. Oh, God. Here we go. Skellies. Now, I just feel, I just want to filter these guys in. That's just kind of my... My dungeon crawling instinct is to back Craig up and just let these idiots try funnel in one at a time. That's going to impede their archers a lot. <sighs> What, what, what would be wrong with that? Am I wasting turns? Am I losing abilities for that? No, Craig, go back one. Yeah. Yeah, let these idiots move in. Like, that's just, that's just to me, is just Dungeon 101. But I feel like they're just going to kind of hang tight. Oh, this, okay, here we go. Oh, yeah. Yeah, they're just, they're just kind of beating dicks about it. <laughs> So Craig, so I think I am gonna storm in there actually. Um So Craig is probably gonna deal with him. But Scoundrel is invisible, so I might get her to try and move up on Ooh, the Ranger Elite. That guy's gonna be a pain in the butt. So why are these in the why are these burned? I used them, but I thought they would just go into my discard. Why are they burned? Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Move two. We need, we need a better move. We need a better move. Throwing knives. Range three. Okay. Yeah. Okay, we need to move. I guess we'll do that. Oh, that's a good heal, though. Shice. Crater. And then crushing grasp. Okay, I like it. I like it. Go. Oh. Still could be tricky. Um, so we are going to move three, then he's going to be, that's really just going to get me there, but I, 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 I'm just so, I'm just so worried about wasting turns and wasting abilities. I'm, that's kind of what I'm feeling insecure about in this game. Okay. Confirm. Go there. Okay. Oh, this is the poisoning bull, bull junk. Confirm to we get. Stay invisible. Now I can move and attack again. Maybe I'll move her even further in. Yeah, that could be a 
bad idea. But I'll get a little closer to the elite, actually. Let's do it. I, I don't know. Just go for it. Just, just go for it. Go in it. Confirm. Let's get that attack in there. Plus one. Oh, not quite enough to kill the dude. That's all right. Craig's on it. Craig, get in here. Oh, Craig's not until after uh, Chubsky's here. All right, Craig. Okay. <laughs> oh, he can move. He can move all the way in here. That would be great, actually. But I maybe I'll leave him for the scoundrel. And, oh, but he should attack. It's gonna kill him. God, it's so hard to choose. Just yeah, just go here, and we'll just do the attack. That's dope. <laughs> oh, and that's gonna kill him anyways. Good. So he doesn't even need to use the, gra the grasp. Okay. Can I attack that? Nope. Skip attack. Okay. And Craig. Oh man. All right. This is still toy. This is toy. Craig, you gotta move a three. Which isn't a lot. One, two, three. No, let's fudge all, really. Maybe he'll do this. Move and then heal. Shield, all allies. I like that. Okay. I like that. That's some very supportive stuff. Now for the skindle. Yeah, why did those burn? I'm 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 curious as to why those maybe those cards are specific. I just don't know. Throwing knives we can do because I want to get that elite out of there. The elite's making me worried. That's cool. The bottom attack must do, or even just the attack. But this will give me throwing knives, range of three, which will get them. Because I don't have a movement, so this might not be the. Yeah, I don't have a movement, but this should still do it. Okay, and selection. I think I'm first in the initiative. Yes, I am. Very nice. So we're gonna do the. I'm gonna do this. Next more attacks. Blah blah blah. Get the super rogue buff, and then we should be able to hit this guy. Ooh, add him. No. <laughs> For bonus damage as well. Get his friend. Don't forget. Nice. Oh, he's out. Oh, yeah. Good job, scoundrel. Okay. Uh, unstable up. So, okay. So, what did I... So, the, I got my supportive abilities. Suffer one damage. I wanted to do this, actually. Shield. So, I hope that's going to shield him. All allies suffer one damage. What? Shield two affect all allies. I don't I don't understand that. Well, let's just do it. So, he's going he's gonna to suffer damage, but he's going to have a shield of two. So, you basically gain one. Receive the damage. Yeah. But now I have a two shield, which I don't know much about the shield mechanic. Now, I, But now I can completely heal her. Or myself? No, we heal her. Because she's she's doing some serious damage dealing. We, we like Scoundrel a lot. Confirm. Good job, Craig. Playing the supportive role. Craig's so fatherly. Ooh. Take it, girl. So maybe the shields reduce the damage? I think the shields probably reduce the amount of damage that's incoming. That's actually really dope. So, <laughs> do you take damage for you? Hit a trap? What an idiot. Okay, uh, Earth and Cloud. What do we got left? We got a move of three, the tornado bull junk, and then the attack. One, two, three. Oh, yes, he can. Okay. That. Attack to range five. He could do that on the next one. So let's do that. Because I think he should be able to get out of him. Okay. Skundalil. What do we... Thieves knack. Attack three. Disarm one adjacent trap. Oh, she could disarm that trap. Which is kind of stupid to me, though. It's, it's, it's single out. Attack. It's like, it's like this kind of clues in for you automatically. But it's got a crazy high initiative. I feel like she has to short rest. 
Lose one discarded card at random in order to recover all discarded cards. Or long rest, choose one discarded card, so I get a pick, it's not random, to become lost to recover all the cards. And I also get to heal, but that's a crazy long initiative. At this point, I don't think it matters. Let's do short rest. I don't need to heal. It looks like I lost my shields, though. So maybe that, that's just temporary. But it was good, because I took because I took a couple hits. Yep, short rest it. Burn Venom. Ooh, Venom ship's good. But I don't want to redraw, because then I damage myself. So let's just go for it. That's how she goes. So Venom ship is now in the burn pile. And now all my discard has, become back into, has come back into my hand. Okay. So what does that give me? I still got the pick. Ooh, that's good. Yeah, I like the special mixture. That's a cool one. Are you guys adjacent? No, you are not. So we'll do that. Flanking strike. Okay. Oh, and I picked for... What's his name? Oh, yeah. He's going to go and attack him. Okay, cool. Let's go. Ooh, that was a little bit of, little bit of thinking. Okay. So we're going to put you... Oh, don't go that way. Can you, like... Yeah, go here. And I should be able to continue moving. Yeah. Yeah, we want to go here. Confirm. Good. Now my action is I got to poison one of these mofos. Ooh, maybe I'll poison him because he's only down to two. So maybe he'll take another hit of damage on, like, the next turn or something. Poison. Attack of three plus two, blah, blah, blah. Do it. Take out this punk. Good night. <laughs> okay, and the scoundrel. Oh. Yeah, take it. You can take it. Oh, Jesus Christ, take it. <laughs> okay. So we're going to move three. And we're going to take out him. Okay, confirm. And, yeah. Do it. Boom. And Craig's turn. Okay. All right. What's up with the scoundrel? What do you got? Thief snack. Move to. Okay. Move to. Move to. Okay. Just something that'll do, do, do the damage. And then Craig. And we'll short rest him. Burn it. And then just do what you need to do, dude. Good range on that. He's going to go first. Yeah, yeah, we get it. And then you're going to do the uh, range five. There you go. Finish him off. Nice. And Craig's turn. So is there still more? Where's the next door? Is that it for this place? I think that's it. I don't see another door. Well, loot two. And you can move. Hey, there we go. Hey. <laughs> cool to quite far from that. Cool. Awesome. Got that one done. First first go first round was tricky. Um, but I was learning how the, the hand and the discard and the burning worked. Um what's next? Burn tavern. Ooh. So that was just kind of like an in-between there. Very interesting. Here. So just getting past 40 minutes, Dude, gonna keep it a shorter video, but I just wanted to touch base on the gameplay for Gloomhaven. So first round got smoked pretty quick, but that really taught me how to understand how the hand works, burning, discarding, replenishing your hand. Uh, so it makes so it makes a lot more sense. So the second round was able to give it a go. But uh, man, I like how the artwork's carried over. I mean, the 3D graphics are okay. Nothing to nothing you know that blows me away by any means. Um, but 
the selecting your abilities but i mean that's the thing is this game isn't about that you know it's about the ability cards the thinking the mechanics and there's definitely a lot of that i, I had a lot of fun trying to pick mix and match abilities um which is the up and down thing that's a very common thing in board games so really liked it pretty happy to be able to get my hands on this and play it so if you haven't checked it out it's gloomhaven just released for early access on steam uh, i'll put a link in the description go check it out thanks for checking out the video like subscribe all that usual junk take care thanks for watching